I'm so excited about season five. Thank what you. What can you tease for the fans? Oh, gosh. What can make it exciting for um, this year? Well, you know, in the nature of our show, we pick up immediately where we left off. And so we left the audience with a huge cliffhanger of, you know, what happened to Ezra. Mm-hmm. Ezra got shot. Is he dead? Is he alive? So you find out what happens. <laughs> also, um, you know, Allie's back, and she's yeah. really back this time. And so everything is different. Nothing is the same. The leader's back, and um, it kind of changes the dead dynamic a little bit, not necessarily for the good. Um, so uh, lots of changes simply because of that. It's uh, a lot going on. So Ezra, who is your love interest on the show, got mm-hmm. shot for you. Um, did bullet. he finally do enough to convince you to forgive him? You know, because I've had guys do some things for me back in the day. No one has ever gotten shot. It's for kind me. of the ultimate, right? It is the ultimate. I don't know. But it's got to be true love. But then, but then again, you know, he their whole relationship was based on a lie, and so it's like, is a bullet enough for that? Like, does it balance it out? I want to say it kind of breaks even. Right. But uh, let's just start over again. But uh, now you, it's a wash. <laughs> exactly. So you kind of, you know, you delve more into that in yeah. season five as well, but. Yeah, I mean, he kind of did the ultimate no-no, which was lie. To a, I mean, I, the whole show is based on lies, but now that the tables have turned and Arya was lied to, right. she's not the liar. It's kind of, uh, yeah, it kind of definitely changed things for them. But doesn't but. Arya know that the title of the show is Brutally Lying? Doesn't so she know? Going to lie. I know, told her? right? Everyone in Rosewood is messed up, so <laughs> gradually we're going down the list. <laughs> yeah. Um, how does it feel to be part of a show that is just still, like, so resonates with the fans? Your fans are so passionate. The ratings are better than ever. I mean, for yeah. season five to have this much energy and excitement about the show, is that really rewarding for you as an oh, actress? Oh, totally. Yeah. I mean, I think I speak on behalf of the whole cast that it's like, you know, we work really hard. It's a, it's a difficult show to shoot sometimes just yeah. based on the hours, but it's totally worth it and gratifying that people are still loving it and enjoying it and tuning in and tweeting about it and... We, we always think, like, we've hit the peak, and then it'll somehow, like, decline, but it's still, we're still on the incline, which is crazy after five years, and that you know, doesn't really happen in TV a lot. It's, it's really rare, and, um, and especially to still be so emotionally invested in the character. I, I, I still absolutely love playing Arya, and I can't wait to see what, you know, to read the next scripts and get to see uh, the different, you know, sides of her that I get to play, and... Um, so it's very creatively fulfilling still, which is which is awesome. Um, if you were a betting girl, how much time would you bet that's left on the show? Like, do you think about how many more seasons? Like, how many more se- yeah, yeah, I mean, I think we all are, like, I think we'd all like to see it wrap up with a movie. Mm. Like, um, obviously, we're doing season five. I think we'll wait to hear about season six. But I think, like, for all of us, the the dream would be to wrap it up with a film. I think that, be that would be cool. Yeah. A trilogy of a trilogy. Let's just say yeah. that now. We'll be like, we'll all be like Bitter in our late Star 30s. Wars. and <laughs> Yeah, because it's funny because we're all, we, I started the show when I was 20. I'll be turning 25 in like a month. And so yeah. we've kind of grown up together. It's it's really crazy. What can you tell us about how Ari is the season as far as, you know, I feel like she went through a lot last season. Obviously, she ended the season with Ezra in a mm-hmm. very dark place. But um, do you feel like this season for her is different than the previous seasons in any way? And sort of like, what would yeah. you just, how would you describe her journey this year? I mean, I feel like this season for Arya is the season of forgiveness mm-hmm. and seeing how much she can or cannot forgive. Mm-hmm. And uh, I mean, especially just going back to um, to Allison being yeah. back. I mean, yes, they're overjoyed that their friend is alive and back, and um, you know they miss her and they love her dearly, but things are not the same as when she left. They all kind of grew as individuals, and now that she's back, like, they can't just pick up where they left off. So it's kind of just really adjusting to that. And so I think that each girl, you know, Arya, obviously, but each girl is kind of trying to fit the mold and see how it's all going to play out. I just want to talk about the vibe on set here, because Mm -hmm. I have done a lot of set visits in my time at E, and... This is perhaps the most peaceful set I have ever been it's on. It's chill, right? I was yeah. just telling your PR rep that I'm convinced that it's actually yeah. a day off, and these are all plants, they're yeah. all actors. Like, everyone working behind the scenes is so yeah. nice and so sweet it's, and so helpful. And I'm telling you, that's the secret of the show, mm-hmm. is um, it, it just all works. Like, everybody wants to be here. When everybody is happy and excited to be here, it works. Right. I mean, yes, we've got wonderful writers, the cast is great, but it's just when you have that chemistry, mm-hmm. not even just with the cast, with the crew, with the producers, with the writers, it just all, everybody's willing to work and compromise and 
it's just really lovely to be here and work here and I can honestly say I wake up every day like excited to come to work and I know that a lot of people can't say that so I feel really grateful and lucky it feels like a like a first season of that to me it's right like a fifth season that like wow people are so excited to be here and grateful and grounded and it's yeah, very cool yeah it is and I try you know when it's an early morning or a really late night I always try to keep that in mind right yeah it's not gonna last forever no yeah it's not <laughs>